don't buy the new 50 car garage for 2.7 million dollars in detail line and buy this instead buy the ceo office and garage and get a 60 car garage for just a little bit more money but i mean the the ceo offices and garage go on sale all the time the 50 car garage it's been in the game for just about a month now and it still hasn't gone on sale yet so if a deal does come out for the ceo office and garage hop on that because that is so much more better and even just for one million dollars extra it's still so much better and i'm gonna explain why so the 50 car garage i mean it's just a copy and paste of the OG 10 car garages, but this time in different levels. It's not even connected. It's, there's no staircase that you could walk from top to bottom. You have to go floor to floor inside of the elevator. They just copied and pasted it with lighting changes, and that's basically all they did. And they're charging $2.7 million for it. You could get 10, 10 car garages cheap for cheaper than just this 150 car garage, which is basically the same thing as the 10 car garages, but copied and pasted in one building. But you still have to go through loading screens to get to all of the different levels. I'm not sure. It's nice. You have three different options. You have immaculate, you have industrial and indulgent, and you have different color options to all three. You don't have to pay extra for them. So that's pretty nice too. They did change the back area. So instead of a little mechanic shop, they turned it into a little hangout, which no one will use, right? They could have copied and pasted the mechanic from Los Angeles Customs or even CEO Garage, put it in here, in the little back area. It's big enough, kind of, to expand a little bit, but no, they just made it into a hangout area with a TV, which no one will use ever. So what you should buy instead is the Maze Bank West Tower. So you could go with any of these really but if you don't have a CEO office already, which you probably do, you can save however much money that CEO office you got was. So for the cheapest option, we're going with Maze Bank West for only $1 million. Now this gives you access to being a CEO, which is really what you need for everything in the game. So if you are a new player and you do want that 50 car garage because it looks kind of nice and it's the newest property added in GTA Online. I would say go with the CEO garage because you're going to be buying a CEO office anyway. So once you spend however much money it is for the CEO office, which again, you could get on sale a lot. So once you buy that, it is time to buy the CEO garage included. So here is where we get to the price difference. So the 50 car garage, $2,740,000 on 50 car garages. That's not connected at all. So we move on to the CEO garage. So you, you have options with this too. Do you want to buy one or buy all three? So the garage one is $1.1 million. Garage two is $855,000. Garage three is $745,000. And the mod shop is $900,000. And that adds up to $3 million, $655,000. So only under $1 million extra and you get 10 cars and you get a mod shop. And if you're in the middle of a city, it's in the middle of the city, which is a way much better location than up at the top of the city. But, uh, but again, the 50 car garage doesn't have a mod shop. So let's say you don't care about the mod shop. It's still going to be cheaper at $2.7 million. So to give them credit, they really did price this pretty good. But is it worth it? For the amount of features you get, no, it's not worth it. You don't get a mod shop and you're getting 10 cars extra with the CEO office garage. And this is the best part. The customization is insane. You have 10 different customization options for each floor of the CEO garage. They do add up in money, but customization options is something they were missing with with this 50 car garage. You have options from lighting to the actual light architecture uh you could change the font on the signs uh you could even change the wall paneling inside the amount of customization they made with this is crazy 
And I don't know why they didn't just copy and paste these options with the 50 car garage. Because it could have been so much better. But yeah, basically the same exact price. Bearing it from the 50 car garage at 2740000 To the 60 car garage, the CEO office garage. At 2750000 just 10000 more. And you get 10 extra spaces. And it has a staircase, so each garage holds 20 vehicles you can walk up and down. And the best part, if you do want to spend that extra $900,000, you can get the mod shop built in. So all you have to do, get in one of your vehicles inside the garage, press right on the D-pad, and you're straight modding your vehicle. You even have access to Benny's vehicles in that mod shop. Which, by the way, Rockstar should really be bringing back some Benny's vehicles. Forget about how special works. Bring back Benny's. Well, yeah, buy the CEO office garage instead and definitely wait until there is a sale because these go on sale a lot. Big discounts. So definitely buy that instead. And one tiny more thing I want to touch on at the end of this video. The 50 car garage does have a little space up on top. But again, nothing's going to stop a jet from coming down at you on top of that building. No one's going to be hanging out with up there instead, except for the homeless people that lives up there on top of your, your multi-million dollar 50 car garage in the middle of the city. You have homeless people living up there. Buy a CEO office and garage instead of this. If you got this far into the video, that probably means you liked it, so leave a like, subscribe to see whatever video I make next.